moment? Uh, you know, it's a surreal experience. I've probably been to, you know, 200 plus basketball games at, in this arena. You know, I had season tickets since I was a little kid. Um, you know, so it was definitely a very, very cool experience to come here. Gotcha. Well, was it everything you kind of dreamt it would be whenever you stepped down? It was. Uh, you know, it was the first time that I've never been able to sing Rocky Top, uh, but it, I was singing a little bit in my head just from habit. But, uh, you know, I had a lot of fun. The atmosphere was great. Uh, you know, take, tip your cap to Tennessee. They made plays down the stretch. Definitely. Um, and, and growing up as well, like, but was it kind of odd not peeing in the stands a little bit this time? It was. <laughs> uh, you know, whether it's football or basketball, I mean, I'm, I'm a diehard Tennessee fan. I mean, I was that kid who was crying his eyes out when Tennessee lost in anything. Uh, you know, so it was, it was definitely weird coming back. But, you know, once you're in between the lines, it's time to compete. Uh, you know, we did that very well. Uh, you know, I just give God all the glory. You know, he just got me here, got me this far. So, uh, but yeah, it was great to be able to play against us. After what, what was your kind of, what were you feeling after you knocked that first one down, hit that three? Yeah, it's always great to get the first one to go. Uh, felt good, kind of got me going. Yeah, I can't, I can't lie to you. I was, this was probably the most nervous I've ever been for a game. I had uh, like 150 people here to watch me. Uh, so to see that first one go was great. Uh, like I said, all the glory to God. You know, I was able to play pretty well, and that's all on him. You know. Um, so yeah, it's great to be back. Great to be back in my city. You know, I miss it. I miss it so much. Uh, I look forward to Christmas break when I can come back. But uh, it's great to be back in Knoxville. Definitely. If you were playing a game that had so much build up, or was this just the, the one that takes? Well, the Well, you know, I play, I played at Bearden. You know, we played in state. We played in the state championship my se my senior year. We played in the state tournament my sophomore and junior year so those were probably as much as this um but yeah this was a big time atmosphere and i was this one i had this one circled since the summer <laughs> i also heard you painted the rock is that a i didn't personally paint it <laughs> um my brother and my buddies um they painted it last night about 4 a.m yeah. you know we thought it was really <laughs> cool you know no hard feelings in tennessee it was just a fun it, they just had some fun with it uh, yeah. you know it wasn't a shot they were just having a little fun but yeah the rock got painted for upstate yeah, and as the game kind of drew on, were you guys, I mean, I'm sure you came in obviously expecting to win, but I mean, did, were you kind of, did you look up at the scoreboard and you deep in the second half and you're up on them? Yeah. That kind of? Well, you know, and I think the Tennessee coach will tell you this. I mean, they knew we were a really good team. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we, we can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with, a lot of, with a lot of teams, and we knew we could with Tennessee. I mean, we knew we would be there in the end. And fortunately, we didn't make the plays down the stretch, didn't have the possessions we wanted. Uh, Tennessee made plays, tipped their cap to them, but it'd be great if we could have a few back, but you know, that's how it goes. Yeah, definitely, man. Did you feel like it was more of a, a business trip or a homecoming trip, or could you differentiate? Well, um, you come in thinking it's a business trip, then you see everything downtown, you know, you're like, wow, I'm home again. You know, you see some of your friends and family, you're like, you know, I'm home. So, but you try, you try to be as business-like as you can, yeah. even though, you know, this place has so many feelings for me. I mean, I love Knoxville. Yeah. You know, when I graduate, I'm coming back home. Uh, it's one of those things. And, but, you know, great overall experience. Definitely. What, what was kind of going through your head? Like you, I saw you were kind of, you kind of seemed like you were just kind of praying and kind of head down right before the game. I mean, were there just so many thoughts going through your mind as you went up and yeah. pointed up to them whenever they kind of cheered for you? Well, you know, I had to do a lot of praying to stay calm. You know, I was, I mean, I was nervous. Um, you know, and like I said, God brought me this far. You know, I give him all the glory. And if anybody can notice that I'm praying, you know, I'm not doing it for my own glory. You know, I'm trying to get people to know who I'm playing for. And that's what I try to do. And, um, you know, like I said, you know, it's a great experience. Yeah, I can't say it enough. Uh, I don't know if I'd want to do it again just because, you know, it's, it can be a little bit difficult coming back and there's a lot of pressure with everybody back. But, you know, absolutely. It's something I'll tell my kids someday for sure.